Jan 9, 2023. Day six. I missed day five. I was out. I was actually filming. And then my storage was too full. So I, I didn't get it done on the empowerment journey. The video log vlog video journal so yesterday yeah there's a lot of stuff rolling emotionally much better better and better every day today's better but i'll start with yesterday yesterday was a big day because i was meeting i was meeting up with a client who wanted to go for a run so i was really making sure that my uh I was feeling good enough to be able to do that. So I was testing it. I went up to the forest with Milo and we were kind of sticking in one area and I was running around like jogging. It's like soft and really focusing on more and more movement, but definitely much better. And yesterday mentally it was, it was like because I was feeling better, there was also this feeling of, well, why can't it just be over now? I'm so close. I'm so close. So, yeah, yesterday was, it was an interesting emotional challenge, but I was staying focused on my, the daily tasks. Milo keeps me grounded for sure. Keeps me going out. Um, focused on moving more. So, yeah, at online coaching session, I'm getting up. Yesterday I got up at five again, doing my meditation, my morning rampage with Esther Hicks, which is great. And then I do my six phase meditation. Uh, sleeping is interesting. Like in the, our bed, it's softer. So like to find the right position is tricky. Like micro movements are uh, tender. So constant reminders once again to like be mindful, take my time, not rush anything. And that includes like the overall recovery. So all in all yesterday was, uh, it was an interesting day, but full of lots of movement progress on that to be able to go out for a run, which I did later on. And, uh, Good rest in between time, rest, recovery, active rest. So today started, I did sleep. I slept a little bit longer. Milo woke up at 11, wanted to go out. So, you know, I was a bit, I can be a bit whiny and whingy at that time. Like, yeah, I'm gonna go back to bed. But it was good, gotta see the moon. Uh, gotta move more and then I transitioned last night to a more like our futon, which is a harder surface. Cushier, but harder. And I slept, I slept deeper on that. So, slept a little bit longer, woke up around six. Keeping the routines going. Part of that's like cleaning up the kitchen, putting dishes away. All these activities that are movement based did my meditation and then we're out and about right now. But definitely better and better from a physical standpoint. Like mentally, there's a lot flowing through and I'm really just bringing myself back to the present moment. Um, Cause other things in my life, uh, when I look upon it can be quite uncomfortable. So being grateful being compassionate, keeping moving, connecting with people, uh, staying focused on this as well, sharing here, putting this out more and more. It's confirmed the magical mushroom experience this weekend, it's on Saturday. So I've had one experience before, Gilear Island off of Bali which is like a mushroom shake that I had. It was quite of a, 
wild experience this outdoor like beach bar area but this will be more private more intimate so we'll see how that goes i really want to dive deep into myself and see what comes out of it kind of integration connection journey psychonaut journey of the mind Yeah, baby. Sharon and Karen, moving and grooving. Day five and six. Better and better. Running, jogging. Yeah. Breathing. Breathing's been the key. Mm, deeper and deeper. Into the nose, out however it comes. <whistles> Feb 20 is my birthday, 41. So, like a lot of the stuff that's coming through me, maybe mentally, emotionally, is about like past stuff, clearing the past, just like being free of maybe any triggers or anything like that. And that's what the meditation helps with, being able to clear all that energy. So each day is new and fresh and I can be present in it and enjoy the flow, not try to over control things, including my recovery. Just like, keep it simple. Keep it simple, man. So have a glorious day. Jan, Jan, I was gonna say January. Feb 9, 2023, vlogging for you from me. It's fresh. My hand's freezing up. It's a good signal. All right. Catch you on the flip-flop. See you soon. Hopefully tomorrow. <laughs>